morning, everyone, and welcome to the morning update. I hope you enjoyed this fabulous fall week and that you have a fantastic Friday. Now, on to the next person. Seniors, now is the time to pay your Naviance transcript fees. Please log into your Naviance account to access your fee balance. Checks can be made out to Maskinamit Regional High School <laughs> and can be dropped off to Mrs. Jennings in the school counseling office at any time. <laughs> On to the next announcement. The Masco cheerleaders are collecting donations for a holiday drive for Hawk, a social service organization committed to ending domestic violence. They will be collecting items until next Friday, November 12th. They are collecting cleaning products, hygiene products, new linens, and much more. Reach out to a cheerleader to see a specific list of items that are needed. Please visit their table tonight before the football game and during halftime to donate if you wish. Hello everyone, this may be the last time this segment will happen for us seniors. So if you haven't heard your college, please listen as it may be on this week's list. On Tuesday, November 9th, Fisher College will be visiting at 4 p.m. On Wednesday, November 10th, New York Film Academy, New York City, will be visiting us at 3 p.m. And the New York School, F School of Design will be visiting us on Wednesday at 4 p.m. On Thursday, November 11th, Framingham State University will be visiting us at 3 p.m. And that's it for this week. Remember, if any of these colleges interest you, log into Naviance, go to the home page, scroll all the way down to see all the colleges. You're going to hit more colleges if you don't see it on that first area. When you see the college that you want, you're going to hit more info. And on the top right, after you hit more info, there should be a register now. Hit the register now and you will be given a confirmation link and a registration link that may have your Zoom link for the meeting. So please keep an eye out for your emails. As always, ask Ms. Delfano for any questions. Okay, seniors, that's it for this segment. Have a great day. Good luck with colleges and take it away. This Sunday, the 7th, there will be a women's self-defense course from 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. held at Coolidge Hall on the Topfield Fairgrounds. You'll learn how to fend from an over and overwhelm an attacker, as well as other tips for staying safe. Look at the Topfield Police Department Facebook page for more information. Sports update for this week starting with volleyball. They had their first states game on Wednesday and they won. Field hockey had their first states game against Marlboro on Thursday, so go check out those scores as well. And tonight, football plays Walpole at home when it's their first playoff game, so make sure you go watch. Tomorrow, girls soccer plays here at 11 and boys soccer plays here at 2. Make sure you go watch and support because we all want to win the championship this year. hosting Walpole in the first round of the football state tournament tonight at 6 p.m. Per the new guidelines, all spectators must purchase tickets electronically for all MIAA tournament play. The tickets are $5 for students, $10 for adults, plus a servicing fee. If you show up without an electronic ticket, you will be asked to purchase a ticket at the door using your mobile device. There will be ticket staff available at the game to help you if you need assistance. However, if you purchase the tickets ahead of time, you will save time. So, find the ticket website on the Masco Athletics page today and go Chieftains! Hey everybody, it's me Paul here! Your motto is for this weekend is working with Saturday's forecast will be sorry. And this is what it is. Saturday, forecast will be cloudy Saturday. And this is two big ways. Also, we bubble. Tune, 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 you can't fuck your own. Your parents are power, yeah. Can we practice at 1 p.m. for the most time? How did you get it? Let's go. Peace. Hey guys, I hope you had a great week. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more announcements next week. Remember, we start with period two today and end with period seven. Good luck to the teams playing this weekend.